we wouldn't say, oh, Grand Theft Auto is open source because I can run it on my own computer and technically I can mod it a little bit. Like that is right. a bastardization of the term. It is not open source, yet we've sort of accepted open source AI as being, well, I can run it on my own computer, which is super cool. Yeah. It's just probably not the right term. I suppose if there is like a set of the llama code out there that you're able to look at, but you're right, most people are going to download a sort of pre-compiled set of weights that they're gonna put into one of various front ends that themselves are possibly open source or not, and then run a local large language model as opposed to like, I'm looking at the backpropagation algorithm for how Llama actually does it. So this open source initiative is saying, you've got to give access to the training data, to the full code, to the model settings, probably even to like the random seed that the things were started off of. The idea being like, you should be able to hit play on this thing and actually recreate it.